What's going on everybody? Abs Gamer here with another Mortal Kombat 1 video. Today I'd like to talk about DLC characters and my personal wish list for guest characters. I know the first combat pack has been revealed with the likes of Homelander, Quan Chi, Ermac, Omni Man, Peacemaker, and Takeda, which I think is a really cool roster of characters. Um, there's also been a rumored leak for the second combat pack, uh, which characters such as Harley Quinn and Deathstroke. I'm not really a big fan of having DC characters intermingling with Mortal Kombat characters, as I think they should be safe for Injustice games. That's just my personal opinion. Next character uh, that was rumored uh, was Doom Slayer, which I thought was an interesting pick. Um, I think he does fit within the Mortal Kombat universe, although I'm not sure how his dialogue would work as he doesn't speak at all. My personal first pick would be Judge Dredd. So with Warner Brothers and Netherrealm having the license to have the likeness of Sylvester Stallone as they did in Mortal Kombat 11 utilizing him as Rambo, I think having him reprise his role as Judge Dredd would be really, really cool to see and they can really modernize his look to fit in well with the other cast of characters and I could already see his movesets and his uh, fatalities. I think he would be a really great addition to the roster. My next pick would be Blade, although I do think that this character has, it's a long shot having him in the game since he is a Marvel character and Warner Brothers deals exclusively with DC characters. But having Wesley Snipes reprise his role as Blade would be pretty cool and I could already see the storyline like him hunting Natara as she's a vampire, she's also rumored to be in the game, would be a really cool storyline. Um, so I think yeah, Blade having, uh, having him in the game would be a really cool addition. My next choice, also a long shot, would be The Crow. Uh, the Crow was one of my favorite movies in the 90s, and obviously Brandon Lee uh, passed away tragically during filming of that film, and he wouldn't be reprising his role here, but you know they could use his likeness or someone could play that character, and I think it would be a really, really great addition to the Mortal Kombat roster as he fits perfectly within the universe. Candyman, which is a horror icon, would be perfect for the uh, DLC guest character wish list as he is menacing. He has that hook on his hand, which could be used for a lot of his moves as well as his fatalities. I could already see it. Uh, Candyman is just a menacing character. And, you know, blood and gore are synonymous with Mortal Kombat. And I think he would fit perfectly within the universe. So, yeah, Can uh, Candyman would be my third pick for DLC guest character wish list. Uh, the next character I'd like to talk about was supposed to be in Mortal Kombat 11, but due to licensing reasons, did not show up. Ash Williams. Uh, I think Bruce Campbell reprising his role as Ash Williams would be perfect for the series. So I was kind of bummed out he didn't make an appearance in Mortal Kombat 11, but he still has a chance for this game. So hopefully we can see Bruce Campbell, you know, as Ash Williams in this game. Uh, that chainsaw and the blood and gore and also the tongue-in-cheek humor of the Evil Dead series would fit in perfectly with Mortal Kombat. So yeah, I think... He would be a great addition. Pennywise, I think we have a good chance of getting Pennywise in the game since Warner Brothers does own the right to it. So I think that, you know, Pennywise is a great character because he's not only a clown, he's a demonic creature that can transform into many different things. So I think that'll be a really cool, um, a cool thing to have in the game. And I can also see the skins throwing back to the nostalgic uh, original movie, um, which would be a great thing to see and also great for a lot of the older fans such as myself. The next character I would pick would be Neo. Uh, having Keanu Reeves reprise his role as Neo uh, from the Matrix series would be really cool to see. I know there's not a lot of blood and guts within the Matrix movies, but, you know, it's pretty violent. A lot of gunplay and whatnot. And I think uh, he would fit in perfectly since he is the chosen one. A lot of, lot of time-altering abilities, such as Garrus and Chronicle utilized, I think he would be a really cool addition. Also, I'd like to talk about a little bit about cameo fighters, uh, if I can. Maybe some guest appearances from horror icons such as Chucky, I think it would be really cool to see. Also, Ghostface from the Scary Movie series would be a really uh, neat thing to see as well, as a lot of fans, you know, that nostalgic kick, a lot of fans such as myself would be happy to see um, characters such as Ghostface within the game. Um, another character which is back from the 3D era uh, from Mortal Kombat in the early 2000s, Meat. A lot of 
a lot of fans have been requesting him as well. Jade has been heavily requested. We don't know if she's on the main roster yet, but a lot of fans have been um, been asking for her as well. Uh, another character could either be main roster or cameo would be uh, King Jared. I know he's within the lore. We've heard a lot about him, but we've never seen him in game or even seen what he's looked like. So I think King Jared would be an amazing addition to the main roster, If, but if not, maybe a cameo. Scarlet was one of my favorites from MK11, so hopefully she can make a, an appearance such a, a, as a cameo or main roster character. So that's it, guys. If you like this video, like and subscribe.